decorated oh, oh. Christmas music's on and we got cookies in the oven what do you say you guys ready to do the family Christmas greeting video I'm too tired from having to haul a tree all by myself these past couple years it sure would have been nice to have some help from a couple boy scouts but apparently they were too busy helping someone cross the street or something anyway I'm too busy snapping Marilla right now yeah you know one of these days I'm gonna learn how to use the interconnected net so I can use that excuse too Internet but you know what I don't have time for that right now because I gotta get my skis tuned up. T Garb and I are going to Big Sky. I just got a 10 point kill streak lead on COD 2. This is amazing. Uh, I have no idea what he's even talking that? about, but uh, it, I don't know, when. I'm just not. Uh, I'm not feeling the spirit here right now, so I'm just not sure if it's gonna come together this year. Besides, I don't have a song ready yet anyway. I'm just ready to throw everyone out. First, they pick the smallest Christmas tree, and then they don't even want to decorate it. Now they're downstairs staring at their screens. See, it's just really sad. I might have to actually spend some money on stamps and send out Christmas cards this year. I don't know, the whole thing's going down the tubes. <laughs> Berkman's are thinking about not doing that Christmas video this year. You know, they always do that thing. It's awesome. Yeah, last year's video was uh, it was a little bit weird because, you know, that guy could really play banjo. I mean, he was an amazing banjo player. And I think there might have been some issues. I, I think he kind of stole the show. What is it? Mom, Mom the Berkman's are going to make a Christmas video this year. Really? Where'd you hear that? I can't believe that. That's the best <laughs> Christmas card ever. Hey Bill, did you hear that the Berkmans aren't doing a Christmas video this year? Do they usually do a Christmas video? I guess. Kind of sad if you ask me. Hey Jim. Hey Ed. What? You know what I heard? No. The Berkman family is not doing a Christmas video this year. Oh, that's a shame. They do one every year. Yes, I know. I'm so disappointed. This is the only way us Canadians can have a connection with them. Yeah. Other, other than if they come up and play bluegrass like they did for us lot this year at the Kekebeka Falls Bluegrass Festival. Yeah, they were awesome, man. Yeah, I really, really enjoyed good. them there. Well, I don't know if you've heard this, but I guess the Berklands are not doing their Christmas video this year, which I'm shocked to hear. Because they do it every year. You know, it's really fun. Really? Yeah, That's they're not bad. doing that. I, I don't know yeah. what happened. That's too bad. No, Really sad, isn't it? I don't yeah. know what that. Maybe something. Maybe they just uh, ran out of videotape or something. Oh, I'm not, uh, who are the Berklands? <laughs> oh yeah, right. Is this City Desk? Yeah. Well, I've got a tip, an anonymous tip for you. Uh, the Berklands are not doing a Christmas video this year. It's like the war on Christmas has come to our town. What? You're kidding me. Well, that's a shame. You know, I don't think I'd get this past the news director. Hey, I tell you what I will do though. I'm going to pay them a visit. I'm going to find out the rest of the story. Yeah, if nothing else, I'm going to kick a little Christmas fanny here. My mom says we don't accept any strangers or solicitors around here. I'm neither a stranger nor a solicitor. I'm here to establish a little Christmas spirit. Is your mom or dad home? Well, maybe. Good. Ah, wait, wait. All right, I'm glad you're all here. All right, I have something to tell you guys, and I hope this is not true. My sources are telling me that the Berkland family is not doing a Christmas video this year. Yeah. 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 All right, if that's the case, let me tell you a little story. Have you ever seen A Christmas Carol? Look, I know you guys are busy, but listen, listen. Remember the story? Uh, Christmas night, um, a bleak and cold Christmas night. Old man Scrooge gets a, a visit from, from the ghost of Christmas past and then the ghost of Christmas present and then the ghost of Christmas future. I saw that movie. It was in black and white. Kind of outdated, if you ask me. You can't compare that stuff with today. The Charles Dickens story is old, but it stands the test of time. It reminded Scrooge of the true meaning of Christmas and to carry it through the rest of the year. So consider me the ghost of Christmas present. And besides, I always wanted to give a pep talk like Vince Lombardi. <laughs>
Who's Vince Lombardi? He sounds just like my dad. He's always talking about old guys and all those old things too. I challenge you, Berkland family, celebrate Christmas like you're supposed to. I challenge you to celebrate the spirit of the season. Sing your Christmas greeting tradition just like you have in the past. To quote the famous Minnesota philosopher Bob Dylan, times they are a-changing. But if that means leaving behind special traditions, I say change schmange. So, on behalf of the spirit of Christmas and all your YouTube video cult followers, I beseech you. Did he just say beseech? Who says beseech these days? Yep, he sounds just like Dad. Yes, I said it. I do beseech you to bring a torch, Jeanette Isabella. Bring a little joy to the world. But goodness gracious, you guys, don't let the Grinch steal Christmas. I've said my piece. My work is done here. Good job. See you on YouTube. Merry Christmas, you guys. <laughs> Who was that? Yeah, he looked kind of familiar. He walked in like he owned the place. And if he's a ghost, he needs to work on his manners. Yeah, he's out of here now, but you know what, guys? I, I think he's right. He's got a good point. You know what? Yeah. It's time to catch a little Christmas spirit. Yep, old-fashioned Christmas. Let's oh go. Boy, here we go again. Grab the base. We're burning daylight. Oh oh One, two, three, four. <laughs>
with magic fill the air when the spirit of the season maps the wonder in our minds. With the message of the Savior, the night so divine. Happy New Year. Stay tuned for the outtakes. Dang it, I forgot my G-Link line. <laughs> <laughs> it's Christmas time in the country Where the bells and the chimes still ring Where we sing of a baby in the manger And rejoice in the birth of our King My mom and Dad say that we don't accept <laughs> <laughs> It reminded Scrooge of the true meaning of Christmas and something else that I can't remember. Oh <laughs> yeah, to carry through the year. Celebrate Christmas like you're supposed to. Celebrate the spirit of the season. And then there's another line that I forgot. <laughs> so on behalf of the spirit of Christmas, I beseech you. Oh, I forgot the Christmas. Oh, video power, oh God! <laughs> oh my gosh! Do those angelic voices still ring clear for all to hear? Where are your angelic voices? <laughs> well, it's going to be a blue Christmas, I can tell you. That's for sure. I'd rather get eaten by a polar bear than to go without yeah. that. I got tears coming down here. <laughs> Well, so we agree. We, we should tell them to, to do it. Oh, yeah. I, I we'll encourage them so. to do I, it I, I one think, way or another. We need, yeah. we, need, we need to get them past that part. Yeah, okay. You know. All right. <laughs> We're burning daylight. I guess we have to. <sighs> okay, Mom, do like it. Come on, Mom! Mom. You, you know, I mean, you guys got to have some. <laughs>